and we're back, baby, for another Road to GM. This right here, I'm playing my man Alex Davladze from Georgia. Is that Georgia? Motherfucker, that ain't Georgia. It's like, is Georgia a country? I really wouldn't even be able to tell you. I'm going to be honest with you. I thought that was a state. But, so, I'll, this was only going to be one video, but my man kept requesting a rematch. So, you're going to see what happens. So, we're at 1370, and we're just trying to get to 1400. That's where the plan is. We surpassed 150 subscribers, man. 200's next, man. Let's get it. Let's get it. We ain't stopping until we get it. All right, man. Let's get going. I go D4. We're going to turn the volume a little bit. D4. D5. Queen's Gambit. He plays the declined, the Austrian variation. I take. He takes. I develop my knight attacking his queen. He slides his queen back, and I take. He takes, and now I just develop my other knight. Now I have open lines with my queen, and if I can get my rook here, I'll have open lines with my rook. He develops his knight, and I develop my bishop, getting ready to, you know, get some forky fork action going. He develops his knight, and I open the door for my light square bishop. He goes and pins my knight to my queen, and I block the pin, also getting ready to castle. He brings his rook attacking my queen, and I just slide my queen out the way, attacking this pawn. He pushes it, defending it, and now I'm winning, but I just castle, you know, get my king to safety. He opens the door for his bishop, and I go and want to trade off pieces. He defends, I take, and he takes with his knight. I give him a check, and he just slides his king out the way. Here, I bring my knight getting ready to do some shit right here. This is big fork, big fork, but his knight's blocking it, so I'm trying to, you know, trade it off. He goes and attacks my bishop, and here I blunder. I move my bishop, attacking his knight, literally hanging my knight, though. As soon as I played it, I realized, and I was like, fuck. I closed my eyes, hoping he didn't see it. <sighs> so here he takes my... Psych! I lied! Big fork on your dome piece, boy! Let's go. And here he resigned, bro. He just took the L, man. And I, I can't be mad at him, but look. He could have got away with some with some funky shit. He could have moved his king. Look, take. He could take. And I also have two pieces hanging. So, but I could defend it with this. So I guess it wasn't that good of a move. Yeah, never mind. GG. GG to my opponent. So that's game one. Yeah, let's go. He plays C4 and I play E5. He plays d4, and I play d6, defending my center. He develops his knight, and now I get ready to fianchetto my bishop because it's already blocked this way. So I'm going to fianchetto, develop my knight, castle. That's my game plan right now. He develops his knight. I fianchetto. He strikes straight in the center. I develop my knight. He goes and attacks my queen, and I block with my knight. He takes. I take with my pawn. Now we have open lines. Queen see each other. Queen see each other. He doesn't make that trade. I go and pin his knight to his queen. The eval bar is all over the place right now. He goes and pins my knight to my king. And I just castle get out of that pin. And he develops his bishop. Now I develop my knight. But I'm already lost. But it don't matter, baby. He takes a pawn. Hanging his piece. I take that. With my bishop, he pushes his pawn, attacking my queen. So I just drop my knight back, re-attacking his bishop. You know, nothing crazy. And now he's just developing pieces. He's hanging pieces left and right. So first, I take that knight. Take the knight with my bishop. Yeah. And bro, he's not even doing nothing. Damn near my, my bishop's trapped. But you know what? Fuck it. Give me a pawn for that motherfucker. He takes, takes, and now I take that bishop. I'm up six points of material right now. I have two pieces. Two pieces and two pawns. Bro, GG. He pushes his pawn, and I go and push my strike in the center, taking that pawn with my knight. Both my knights defend each other, so he can't take with his queen. He castles long. I go, I want a queen trade. Let's make a queen trade. And also, and the reason, because he could have went like this. Take... 
my night with check, discover check, and win that. Oh, wait. No, never mind, because my queen defends it. I'm tripping. My fault, y'all. So I just move my queen out the way. And he goes and attacks my goddamn horse, hanging his queen. Bro's playing angry, because he's been getting smacked upside the head. Bro, and then he takes my knight and resigns again. And he requests a rematch, so you know I gotta oblige. So I run it back. Game three. Go! Coming. Let's go! D4, D5. Queen's gambit. He accepts. I strike in the center. He defends. I go and attack straight away. He defends. I take. He takes. And now I have the open rook, A file. That's why I love the queen's gambit when it's accepted, because most of the time I'll get an open file with my rook. And I'm castling short anyway, so I'm not worried about that. So now I have big lines of attack. I develop my knight. He pushes his pawn. I develop my knight. He stops it. And I just jump forward. He defends it, but look, I'm not worried about him taking because bow. So I just take that pawn. He takes my knight. I take the rook. He takes my bishop. I take his horse. Big trades. I'm up. I have a rook, a knight, and two pawns for him having a bishop, a knight, and two pawns. He develops his bishop, and I go back and take this pawn. Let's go. He goes and pins my knight, or not my knight, my rook to my king, and I block that pin. He slides out the way, and I just castle. Get my king to safety. He develops his knight. I give him a check. Let's trade. Take, take. He takes here. Now I just develop my bishop out. He castles. I take that pawn. He goes in big forks me, or big skewer, I should say. Big skewer. So I just defend my rook. He takes, I take. He pushes his H pawn. And here I just push my B pawn. Goofball, what are you doing? Hanging your rook in one move? That's what they teach you out in Georgia? That's what they teach you out in Georgia? Give me that. And here he resigned again. Bro didn't finish a single game. And he requested another rematch. And I had to decline. Because I was like, bro, you're just not. It's not fun, bro. You're not letting me get checkmate. You're just letting me walk you down. Oh, my God. So that was Bro to GM. Episode 20, I think. I think we just hit 2-0. Two, two big 2-0. So let's go. Let's keep running it up. Like and subscribe. Let's get to 160 tonight. Let's get to 160. I think we can do it. Peace out. Y'all have a blessed one.